This is Diana from the future. And I realize I didn't do an intro for this video. I totally thought I did. I'm like 99% sure I did. I don't know if like when I was trying to free up some storage on my memory card, I accidentally deleted it, but she's gone. So we're doing an intro now. So hello, my amazing, beautiful, wonderful, fantastic friends. For this video, it's pretty self-explanatory. You guys just decided what I ate every single day. I did ask you guys to send these on my Instagram. So if you aren't following me on Instagram, make sure to follow me. Also follow me on Twitch. I did ask you guys for like breakfast, lunch, dinner, dessert, and snacks. I didn't eat breakfast, lunch, dinner, plus dessert and snacks every single day just because my appetite has just been all over the place. So I apologize for that. But whenever I did eat, it was something that you guys chose. Let's just get on with the video. I hope you guys enjoy it. <laughs> okay, also, look at my sweater. So this is similar to the cat sweater that I showed you guys in my last video, but this one has frogs. But for today, let's see. What did you guys pick for today? Excuse me, see all. And then we're just going to scroll and stop. And we landed on peanut butter and jelly and put some fruit in there if you're feeling crazy. I'm always feeling crazy, sweetie. Let's do it. So I'm gonna do peanut butter and jelly with banana. Actually, don't think I've ever had a peanut butter and jelly with banana. Like I've had peanut butter and banana. So this is crazy. We're going wild today. Oh my God. Someone stop her. Do you guys like toasting your bread for peanut butter and jelly? I feel like I don't because I don't know, something about the softness of the bread because I never had toasted peanut butter and jelly when I was younger. So I feel like the softness of the bread reminds me of when I was a kid. I always ate Uncrustables as a kid, which were obviously never toasted. I also always had grape jelly with my peanut butter and jelly, but now I'm a strawberry jam kind of gal. Fan of strawberry jam. That doesn't rhyme. When you try your best, but you don't succeed. When you get what you want, but not what you need. World tour coming soon. My cats are watching me make this like in awe. Put it diagonally, of course. Ta-da! I love when I say like, ta-da! As if it's some five-star Michelin gourmet meal. P B B P B B and J? P B J B? J B? Mmm, mm, that's good. I think I prefer just peanut butter and jelly though, or just banana and peanut butter over combining all of it. I don't know, the banana is throwing off the perfect balance. It's good though. You know what the thing is? Going back to like the toasted peanut butter and jelly, like how I prefer the non-toasted, I like peanut butter banana toast by like untoasted PB and J. I think that's why this is like kind of throwing me off a little bit. The banana is adding extra softness that I feel like would be better if it was toasted. You know what I mean? Does that make sense? Hello, and we are back. I just got out of the shower. I got myself ready for no reason. Not doing anything today, but I feel like doing my makeup. And now it's time for us to figure out what we are going to have for lunch, right? We're gonna scroll and I stop on one and we just see we just see what we're gonna do. I think for the future days, I might do this like first thing in the morning, just in case I need to go to the grocery store to like buy ingredients and things like that. But today let's just scroll and pray that we get something that I can make right now. I'm really craving like, Ramen or tteokbokki. Hold on, let me go to start again. Hi. Hi, Bomi. What do you think it is? What do you, what do you think it is? It is. Yo! Look. I literally got the hooky. Let's go. Oh my God, y'all know me. Thank you. Did you do this for me? I don't even care if you did or not. I appreciate you. Do you mind if the hooky, I do like raboki? Cause it's tteokbokki. You just add some ramen to it, you know? You mind? Cause I'm really feeling that. I hope you don't mind. <laughs> if you don't know how to make dopoki, it's super easy. So I'm gonna show you guys how to do it. I've shown it a few times, but you know, just in case you haven't seen those, we're gonna make it again. So I have just a little bit of water here. I don't like to add too much because I don't like that much. Like you can have dopoki or rapoki where it's like really soupy and there's a lot of extra sauce. I'm not personally a fan of that. I'm gonna add some fish sauce first. That was a little bit too much, but it's fine. And then I'm gonna add some gochujang. Also, some sesame oil. I'm gonna add some shiitake mushrooms. This is optional. 
I'm just obsessed with mushrooms, so I'm gonna add them. Once it's brought to a boil, you're gonna add your tok, which is just rice cakes. So these little cylinder rice cakes that you can get at like any Asian grocery store. And then you basically just keep cooking them until the rice cakes are done. And you'll know that it's almost done when it starts to like thicken up. Then once it gets like this, turn the heat off. And then we add the cheese and cover it. And you just wait. Okay, last thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna cut up some seaweed. Ta-da. Oh my goodness. Mm. Oh, so good. I can't believe I actually landed on tteokbokki. The person who sent in tteokbokki, I love you. I was really craving that. Hello? Hello? <laughs> oh my God, they're having a conversation. They're communicating. Oh my God, so good. Dinner time. Dinner time, dinner time, dinner time. Let's see. Will you guys be good to me again? Will you guys come in clutch again? I don't really know what I'm craving though. I hope someone said like Thai takeout. That would be boring for you guys though. Like it would be boring for you guys. It would be fun for me. I love Thai takeout, but it'd be boring for you guys. So I guess we'll just see how the stars align, where they bring us. I'm gonna look away. I'm gonna scroll. I really hope it's something that I can make right now. Oh, frick. I, sc I swiped away. I swiped out of the app. What's going on with me? It's fine. Dude, the way I'm not making this up, the way I'm not making this up. Hello? Hello? Are y'all watching me? Listen, I'm just I'm just doing what y'all picked. You guys just, mwah, mwah. I love you guys. Thank you. I'm getting my usual, let's freaking go. Y'all have seen this meal so many times and I'ma keep showing it. Cause it's just that good. It's also like, there aren't a lot of good places around here to order food. Unlike at my last apartment, I feel like I, there were so many options. But this is really like the only decent place I order food from. Oh, I see she looks so cute. It's just fire. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So that's upside down. Oh, there's something in my eye. Good morning, beautiful people. So what we're gonna do this morning is we're gonna go through like what you guys pick for breakfast, lunch, dinner, dessert, and snacks. Just in case I have to go to the grocery store right now and I have to just buy anything. Okay, going to the breakfast section. I almost reported something. We scroll, and we're gonna stop. And we got, okay. <laughs> we got oatmeal right there. Wow, when is the last time your girl had oatmeal? I definitely have to go buy some oatmeal because I don't have any. And then we're gonna go to lunch. We're gonna pick the lunch. We're scrolling. We're stopping. We got grilled cheese. Can I cheat just a little bit? <laughs> it says grilled cheese and then another person said fries. So if we just, what if we just have both? I think she's annoyed by the people doing the lawn or something outside. And then we're moving on to dinner. Ah! We got kimchi fried rice, let's go. Yes. I'm totally down for kimchi fried rice. Let's freaking go. And then Dessert wise, dessert, dessert, dessert. That's literally the same exact one I picked yesterday. So we try again, we try again. Cinnamon rolls, okay. Let's do cinnamon rolls for dessert. And then lastly, any snacks that we might need. We got pretzels and hummus. So that is the day for today. Whoa. There's my baby girl. There's my pretty baby girl. Oh, I love you so much. Okay, back from Target, just got out of the shower, got myself put together and ready. I also got this new bowl. It's a black bowl because spooky season, I guess. And I used to eat these all the freaking time. These are like the better oats, maple and brown sugar. I don't know if you guys have been like watching me for that long, but I used to eat these all the freaking time. Let's make, I don't know, maybe like two or three of them. I think I'm gonna mash a banana, mix the banana in it, and then add peanut butter. You know, I haven't had oatmeal in a while, so maybe I'll enjoy this. Mmm, this is actually really good. Mmm, it's been a while since I had it. And I think a break is what we needed because I'm loving this right now. Oh my God, it's actually so good. <laughs> Oatmeal's making a comeback, baby. Currently about to start making my kimchi fried rice for lunch, um, but I am hungry. I'm gonna have my snack now. I have the pretzels and I have this hummus. They didn't have my garlic hummus that I usually get, the cedar's garlic hummus. So I got this sun-dried tomato and basil hummus. 
Wait, was kimchi fried rice supposed to be my dinner or my lunch? It wasn't. No, it was grilled cheese. Grilled cheese. I must make kimchi fried rice. Grilled cheese for lunch. Kimchi fried rice for dinner. That was a close one. My lunch is served. I have my ketchup right here. Grilled cheese. This would be really good with like some soup. So plain and simple, but so good. Hot. Hot. God, I love burning my mouth. And it's done. Super easy, super quick. Literally anyone can make this. Hello friends, I just got out of the shower. I'm getting a very, very late start to the day. It's already um, like 5 p.m. I slept in today, like slept in. I'm not sure what happened. I set an alarm for eight in the morning. I got up, went to the bathroom, just lay down in my bed like I usually do to, you know, cuddle with my cats for a little bit. Ended up passing out, woke up at noon. Not sure how that happened, to be honest, because I went to bed like around like one, two in the morning. So I feel like I slept for almost 12 hours. I'm really not sure how that happened, but nonetheless, it did. Very late start to the day. So we are just starting off with lunch. We scroll and we stop. Okay, we can do that. We got ramen and dumplings. Do you see how dramatic this boy is? You're so dramatic. You're so dramatic. Now I'm eating dumplings. Let's see what we have for dinner. Just, you know, in case I have to run really quick to the grocery store. We got, ooh, nice. Pizza or Chinese takeout. And I'm gonna go with Chinese takeout because there are no good pizza places near me. Do Chinese takeout for the night. Okay, but let's make the ramyun and the dumplings first. Two packs of ramyun, some japchae dumplings. I fried an egg and I sliced it. This is just, just egg. I'm starving. I went to like hibernation this morning. I've been setting alarms early in the morning so I could wake up earlier and hopefully like fix my sleeping schedule. But it's resulted in me getting like five to six hours of sleep. So maybe I just was catching up on sleep. Mm. Also, sorry, I didn't eat the cinnamon rolls last night. I was so full and it was like midnight at that point. I could not force myself to eat. Mm. God, I love noodles. So I got my Chinese food. The Chinese takeout place that I usually order from because I sell french fries is closed or it's unavailable on Uber Eats for some reason. I'm not sure why. Very upset about it. But I just got something that I usually get. Oh, they gave me two rices. So I only asked for one. I got general Tso's tofu. I usually get sesame tofu, but I was feeling different today. And then mixed vegetables. Pretty basic, pretty simple. Kind of wish I got pizza. Wish I like ordered pizza, but there's literally no good places near me that sell vegan pizza. Can't really go wrong with Chinese takeout. Okay, back at it again. We're gonna see what we're having for breakfast. Breakfast, hi Bomi. We landed on, excuse me. Woo! You're just trying to sabotage me. Sir, I'm gonna have to ask you to get down. Mac and cheese for breakfast, which I mean, not opposed to, not opposed to. How you make my mac and cheese? It's very, very, very easy. Butter, and then you can add any cheese you want. I like adding multiple cheeses because, yes. And you just kind of mix it all together. Garlic powder, pepper, and paprika. Voila. That's it. So I just got done streaming. Well, not just, I got done streaming like an hour ago. It was, I had a long stream today. I played a game called Little Misfortune. It was so sad. So, so sad. So it's 6 p.m. and I got popcorn as a snack. I forgot to show you guys, but I thought I was hitting record, but I did get popcorn as a snack. And now we're just gonna go to dinner. Black bean noodles. Mm. I feel like I haven't had black bean noodles in a while. The chicken, got the vegetables, got the noodles. We're good, baby. Ha! Oh my God, you can see the steam coming out of my mouth. My God, black bean noodles are so good. Mm. Um, it's 5 p.m., my bad. Uh, so what we're gonna do is I'm going to have breakfast and lunch. I just, I really apologize. I got a super late start to the day. Basically, I was, I was just like, okay, so I'm gonna start editing first, 
and then we'll get on to the video. And I ended up waking up really late. I've been just like letting myself sleep in and I end up getting like just a stupid amount of sleep. I'm just kind of allowing it to happen. I am going to bed at like a somewhat decent time, but I'm just sleeping in a lot. And I'm just trying to let myself, let my body do its thing. I don't know what's going on, but again, we're just kind of letting it happen. So we're gonna go to breakfast first and then we're going to scroll and stop. And we got granola and then for lunch, we scroll, we stop, and we landed on, ooh, we landed on Athena. Hey, Athena, how are you doing? They said, ignore the one next to it. That's just my friend being an idiot. But they said a sandwich, sandwich with fries or chips. I don't have any more fries. So we're gonna have to do some chips. Okay, I think I'm gonna make a BLT. And um, what kind of chips do I have? Yes. I have Doritos. Kyo, don't, 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 don't. Kyo loves to like just chew in bags of chips. Orange cat behavior. Granola, I have some Kashi peanut butter crunch. This granola is fire. Gotta wait for the bacon to cook. I'm just eating the granola as we wait. Do you want some? The bowl matches you. I don't have to fight off Bomi that much compared to Kyo, because Kyo will actually eat anything. Bomi gets more curious, like she just sniffs. Here's a sandwich. Just BLT with cheese and mayo. This used to be my Subway order. That was like my childhood. Mm. Ah, no! I don't know what the hell they put in Doritos. There's something super addictive in the ingredients. I know it. I don't even think that's a joke. I think there really is something in Doritos that makes them extremely addicting. If you know what ingredient that is, let me know. Dinner time. Let's see what we're having for dinner tonight. Loki wanted to be takeout, but it's also almost 10 p.m. So places might not even be open. And we do the usual, we just scroll and we just see what we land on. My cats are looking at me. I have to feed them in like a second. Um, okay. Spaghetti bolognese, which I feel like I actually haven't had in a while. Do, 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 do. He doesn't mind tummy rubs. Bowie's not the biggest fan of them, but he kind of likes them. He seems to like them. Oh, you're purring, you're purring. Yeah, he likes them. Bomi's not a big fan. Usually cats don't like tummy rubs, but Kyo seems to like them. Look at these beans. Look at these toe beans. So when it comes to my spaghetti bolognese, if you haven't seen me make it yet, I've made it so many times, but you know, just in case you haven't. And then I'm gonna add tomato paste. Here's where you'd wanna add some like fresh garlic, which I don't have. So I'm just gonna add a little bit of garlic powder. But again, if you have like fresh garlic, that would be way, way, way better. The pasta sauce I've really been loving is the spicy Italian plum tomato marinara. It's really, really good. I didn't have that in frame at all. Then the last thing I add is Parmesan cheese. And that's basically it. Meals that are delicious and easy to make are the best kinds of meals. Sometimes simple is better. Sometimes simple is best. This might not actually be like spaghetti bolognese. It's just kind of how I've always made what I perceive to be spaghetti bolognese. So I apologize to anyone that's like ripping their hair out at me. Bada bing, bada bing, bada boom. And voila. Doesn't look very appealing, honestly, but looks don't matter. You know, it's about the flavor, what's on the inside, the personality. I really have to get my hair touched up. What should I dye my hair? Should I keep the pink? I think I'm gonna keep the pink still because I really dig this pink. I can't touch it up real bad. But what about the next color? I'm wondering if I should go back to like brown, if I should do like a purple. I like can't picture myself with dark hair anymore. That is divine. <laughs> that is divine. That is exquisite. 10 out of 10. I feel like it's near impossible to mess this up. I used to eat my food like that when I was a kid, like pasta or noodles. My mom would get so mad at me. Hmm. Got my little buddy with me. I'm gonna show you guys. Hi, thanks for keeping me company. Has that not been recording this whole time? Okay. I'm a mess. It's almost midnight. I just, oh, this is so unstable. Like my mental health. I thought I was filming this entire time. I've been filming for like 15 minutes, but I basically found a dessert to have and someone just said fruit, and the only fruit, thank God I had fruit, I didn't think I had any, but I have this lone apple. And yeah, so I'm just having an apple now for dessert. I was off my dessert game this whole week. I'm so sorry about that. I think honey crisp are my new favorite apples. They're so juicy. That's gonna be it for this video. I really hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, please give a thumbs up to let me know. If you absolutely hated it, you can give it a thumbs down. That's okay too. But, uh, oh, 
And before you go, if you haven't already heard today, you are amazing, you are beautiful, you are wonderful, you are so valid, and I am so, so happy that you are alive. I love you so, so much, and I hope to see you in the next video. Bye.